Hi, this is Dr. Don. I want to take a few minutes and go over question three in the remix in lab two. It's given some students some problems. So let's look at it. Here it is in the, the lab manual or re, the remix for lab two. And the first question is in the lab zero two describing data rehearsed, describing data is the second rehearsed, we found descriptive statistics for Gapminder data for life expectancy for each continent. Copy that code chunk, and this is the part that people are missing as edited. In other words, we've got to go back to the rehearse, get the code that was not edited, and then edited appropriately. And so let's, let's do that. I'm going to jump here over to that rehearse. And here it is, section 5.1 on life expectancy. And here's the instructions. Here's the code that we've got to edit. And here's the instructions for editing it. Change the data frame, the source data frame, my DF, which is right there, to get my DF. Change the conditions in the group by, because this was looking at con uh, conditions. We want to group by continent. So we would change that to continent, which is the other another variable. And then we've got to change the scores, where it says scores that variable to life expectancy, LIF capital EXP. So let's copy that. Go back over here to our Studio Cloud, and here's our empty code chunk. And I'm going to control V and paste that in there. So the first thing we've got to do is change this to be Gapminder. And I'm just going to edit here. Get, whoops. my cursor in the right spot, edit. And we want to group by continents. Continent, whoop. And we want to change this to life expectancy. No space. Okay, I've got all those edits changed there. Gapminder DF, continent to group by, life expectancy for the four variables here. And then we just run the code and we've got our summary table. We see the five continents and what the mean life expectancy is for each of those, as well as the standard deviation, the min and the max. So that's pretty interesting. Let's move on to the next part. We scroll down here. And this quite a few students are missing. And it's what is the mean standard deviation, min and max life expectancy again? for all the gap minder across all years and countries. So we haven't filtered for year in this, but we did group by continents. So it gives us the hint to not use the group by. And that's all I did here was to edit out that row up here where it says group by and, and get rid of the pipe there as well. So you end up without that row there. And we've got to summarize again, everything else is just what we need so we can run it. And there is the mean standard deviation, min and max, life expectancy across all continents in all years, which is what we needed for this. So then you would just answer the questions here. Which continent statistics are most like the overall statistics, etc. So answer those and then you would move on to the next question. So I hope this helps on problem three.